We're here at the final press conference for Sebastian Fundora and Brian Mendoza, and we have Brian Mendoza here who will be fighting for the, his first WBC belt. How do you feel this fight week? I feel amazing. You know, this is dream come true, and um, but the dream will come true once I get that belt wrapped around my waist. You know, I'm not one of those people that's satisfied fighting for the title. I've always dreamt about having that green and gold wrapped around my waist, so I'm, I'm super excited and just ready to go on fight night, get my first belt. And you've told me this before years ago. I remember you're like, I want that green belt. Now this is your opportunity, and you pulled an upset your last fight. You think you can pull it off again? I know I can. I know he hasn't worked like I have. He hasn't uh, suffered and sacrificed in the gym like I have. So there's nothing I feel like I, I can't be denied. This is my moment. I want that green and gold like I told you years ago from day one. Um, it, it's just my moment, and I'm ready. How much does that green and gold belt mean to you, you know, working so hard from your young career to now? It means everything. You know, I keep saying this win means everything. This green and gold belt means everything. I've had a, you know, I've had a few setbacks and everything, but this is proof now, you know, that as long as you have faith, you know, you keep grinding, keep working hard, you can, you can come back from anything and uh, you can, you know, make it to the top. You know, I'm here fighting for a belt and it's just everything, you know, this is to show everybody that it can really be done. On Saturday, are you going to have, you know, you're obviously from Albuquerque, but you've been training in Vegas. Are you going to be having a lot of your family, friends and come support you? And how much do your fans mean to you? Yeah, even just now during the press conference, my phone kept buzzing, you know, from people saying they're watching it and that some people already just landed from Albuquerque. They're, they're driving in. So, yeah, there's tons of people out and um, Albuquerque knows how to show love, you know, for big events like this. So I'm super excited and I'm super excited, you know, just to add uh, another one on the short list of champions that we've had from New Mexico. There's a legend out of Albuquerque, Tapia. How, how, was he an influence in your career? Absolutely. You know, just uh, having someone, because like I said, it's a short list from New Mexico, but being able to see somebody up close like that, you know, knowing it's real, it's feasible, you know, that's, that's huge. It was everything. So um, that's big, but I'm just excited. You know, I, I want to hopefully, you know, be a representation or kind of not so much a role model, but, you know, just inspiration to somebody like that. Well, a role model, you know, a new a new face to Albuquerque, right? Um, all the sacrifice, everything that you work hard for, Saturday is going to be your moment. What can the fans expect from you? They can expect another explosive performance. This is, um, like I said, we uh, we left no stone unturned. We just we suffered and sacrificed like like you wouldn't believe in the gym. I just dedicated my heart and soul to this, and that's what you're going to see on fight night. Y esto es para todos los latinos también. Aquí vamos. Um, me sacrifiqué. Estoy super listo para mi momento para uh, cumplir mi sueño. Y estamos listos. So miren la pelea que va a ser algo tremendo. Any last message for your fans, for your training camp, for your family? Uh, a message you want to send to them before your fight? To anybody that believes in me, you know, uh, this is for you. Um, I've just, I've worked so hard for this, you know, so I'm not, I'm not paying attention to any of the haters or anybody, you know, saying that it's impossible and this and that. But if you believe in me, if you've rocked with me at all, you know, in these last, uh, like, nine years, I believe, as a pro or, or even before, um, this is for you. So let's go and get it Saturday night. Everything is possible. And like always, the WBC is in your corner and supporting you. Where can the fans follow you if they don't already follow you on your social media? My main social media is Instagram at La Bala Mendoza, um, but I'm all across the board. Brian uh, Marino Mendoza at La Bala. You can find me everywhere, but definitely Instagram for the most up-to-date information on my fights and everything. Thank you so much, Brian, and we wish you the best of luck this Saturday. Thank you so much. Thank you for always showing love, by the way. I appreciate that. Okay. <laughs>